Okay, my microwave went out. Power is not working. It is a Frigidaire LFMV164QFA. Of course, it was built in June of 2016, and shortly after the two year warranty was up, it's not working. However, I believe I can fix this for about $3. It's more than likely just the fuse. So what we're going to do, there's two screws on the top that we're going to take off. And then open the door and you want to pull forward on the top like that, it's going to make a little bit of noise it'll pop right off. And then you got your panel here on the front. Take this one screw out. And just lift up on it. And it'll come right out. You let that hang. Okay. This right here is your filter. If you want to change your air filter while you got this off, you can change that here. Your fuse is going to be behind here. Just got two screws. Pull that out. Voila. Here is my burnt out fuse. Can you get a picture of that? You can see that it's pretty burnt out there. Yep. So I got a went to Home Depot, bought a two fuse set for three dollars and fifty-four cents. So I'll now have a spare as well. So let's pop that in there. This back on. Plug back in the microwave. No, don't plug in the microwave. Well, that's a very good point. Make sure the microwave is unplugged when you're doing this. Otherwise, you could be in for a mighty shock. Yes. Literally and figuratively. Alright, let's see. There's one. And by the way, I'm not allowed to talk, so naturally I am. Benefits of having your child help you with videos. So, <laughs> all right. Just slide the panel back on. Put the screw back in. Take your... Thing. Here. front piece here and just slide it back in. It's going to, it's a little rough to slide in. You got to make sure you get it lined up. It's perfect. Perfect. door, plug it in, and voila, we have a working microwave. So this is how you spend $4 to fix your microwave when the power goes out. I thought it was 3 three fifty-four.